Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Tyler Perry is opening up about his mental health history after the death of Steven Twitch Boss. Boss, a professional dancer, actor, and former DJ and co-executive producer for The Ellen Show, died on Tuesday at the age of 40. And so in the video today, we're going to have a look at Tyler Perry sharing his own experiences of how he overcame the mental health struggles that he was dealing with for several years. Uh, he talks about how, you know, people shouldn't deal with these things or issues alone. People should reach out if they get into these type of situations where they are struggling with mental health. Hey, everybody. Um, I, like the rest of the world, am shocked by the death of Stephen Boss twitch and it prompted me to come on to talk to any of you who are going through um, hard times struggling I didn't I, I've only met him a couple of times he was always full of life and seemed like such a light but with that said I just want to take you back to a time in my life where um, because it was so dark I didn't think it would get any better I had endured so much pain so it, it, it was all so hard to just move through that I thought the only way to make this better. I know you may be going through some things. I know you may seem like there is no hope, but please reach out to someone. I'm, I'm going to post this number. Call, ask for help if you are dealing with anything, anything that is that is emotionally uh, taking you to a place where you think you want to end your life. What I realized now, looking back on all those dark times, is sometimes the pain is a buy-in. I know that's hard to understand. Not all the time. Sometimes the pain is a buy-in. That's the way I had to learn to look at it to, to uh, get through it. What I mean by that is all that pain, all of that hell, all of that struggle. If I had given up, if I had stopped, I wouldn't have seen the better part of my life. So I was buying into something. I was paying for something. I know that doesn't make sense to a lot of people, but for me, it was the way I was able to rationalize it to be able to move through the pain, knowing that if I could just get through this moment and get through this moment, there's got to be something better. And my life now, I'm the happiest as I, I'm the happiest I've ever been. Life is full of joy and love, things I never thought I'd get to. So thank you. My prayers are with you. Let's end this new year loving us, loving on each other, encouraging ourselves. Because it's gonna take that from within. God bless you. Rest in peace, Twitch.